Here we have the Harrison M300 center laid, or sometimes known as an engine laid. So the center laid consists of uh, numerous components. So here we have the headstock, tailstock, the bed. This combined unit here is known as the carriage. The carriage consists of apron, the saddle, and the compound slide. On top of our compound slide is our tool post. Here we have the speed for setting the gears to control the spin for speed. Again, we have more controls here for setting the feed rate. We have our longitudinal, longitudinal control handle, horizontal, and again, compound compound slide for our longitudinal travel again. So here's the spin control shaft, feed rate shaft, and just underneath here is the lead screw. This is the rack which is used by the pinion which is connected to this handle to move the carriage along the bed of the lathe. This particular lathe can accommodate a workpiece of approximately 330 millimeters in diameter. Now, the diameter of the workpiece that you use is restricted by the gap, the distance between the centers here and the bed of the lathe itself. The length of the workpiece then is restricted by the distance between our chuck and the quill here on the tool post. And you can see here, there's a split here in the bed of the lathe. This can be physically removed to accommodate a larger swing or a larger part. So again, when we said this can accommodate a workpiece of about 330 millimeters in diameter, that wouldn't be along the whole length of the wouldn't be along the whole the whole length of the bed due to the restrictions here caused by the carriage.